Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 Team of the Season player review on my channel. So in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 87 rated Team of the Season Fernando. Now, in the nine matches I did play with this guy, he managed to get me six goals from the CDM slash centre mid position. So this guy is very, very good, both defensively and attacking wise. So looking at his stats now, he's got a really good, well-rounded card, um, really nice dribbling, really good shooting, really good passing, um, really good defending, and also really, really good physical. So you know, all round this card is very very good and he also has a good nationality not really the best league but what i would recommend to do is play this guy in a brazilian squad so guys this has been the in-game stats now let's get into the highlights so now moving into the highlights for team of the season, Fernando, the first pro I could find on this card was his long shots, and this guy has absolutely insane long shots, as you'll see from this video, I scored multiple long shots, um, so the first long shot there is a really nice one, the goalie um, gets a touch on it, but tips it onto the crossbar, you know, because the power was just too much um, from Fernando, after that the next pro I could find on this card was his passing, now this guy has a very good passing, short range and long range, he's really good at, you know, just distributing the ball around, and sort of like dictating the play of the game from the centre mid or CDM position and then the final pro I could find this card it was his aggression now this card reminds me a lot of Kante um, he's very aggressive not really the tallest of player but you know manages to be sort of like just bites at their ankles of the uh, attacking players and sort of just frustrates them and then wins the ball back and then the final and only con I could find this card it was his height now this guy is pretty small I think he's around five foot seven five foot eight um, so he's not really the tallest so if you are thinking about playing him in the CDM position uh, you've got to take into consideration he's not really going to be winning too many aerial battles so I think the best position for um, this guy to play is on um, as a wide centre mid position um, because you know it allows him to sort of do some defensive work but also push up the pitch at the same time and sort of utilise you know those long shots so as you can see to end off there we get a really nice long shot into the top corner so guys this has been the highlights now let's get to the overview So now moving into the overview for team this season, Fernando, for a value of coins, I'm going to give him a 7.5 out of 10. At the current time of recording this video, he's going for around 40,000 coins, and in my opinion, for a CDM who's 87 rated and he's also Brazilian with some really good stats, I think that's a decent price, so that's why I decided to give him a 7.5 out of 10. Enjoyment-wise, this card was pretty enjoyable to use, and I'm also I'm going to give him a 7.5 out of 10. Competitiveness-wise, I'm going to give this guy an 8 out of 10. I think this guy is very, very good, um, especially, you know, if you're looking for a box to box midfielder and you want to fit him into your Brazilian team I think he is the perfect option skilling wise is okay he only has the three star skill moves not the four star if this guy had four star skill moves he would be honestly one of my favorite center mids on the whole of FIFA 18 but sadly he does only have the three star skill moves so that's why I decided to give him a six out of ten for skilling and then overall I think this guy I'm going to give him a solid rating of a 7.5 out of 10 I think that's very fair you know looking at the card stats and the way he did perform in the matches so guys this has been the player review if you have enjoyed I want to see more FIFA 18 player reviews on my channel. Don't forget to leave a like on the video and subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you next time.